let's take a look at how you can connect the data and transform it on the way into the Power BI desktop. I'm going to connect to a web page. In this case, it's the IMDb Top 250 Movies page. I'm going to need this URL in just a few seconds. From the Power BI Desktop Getting Started screen, I'm going to hit Get Data. And as I'm going to connect to a web page, I'll search for web and just choose that data source. Now I need to paste back in that URL. And you can see all of the tables in the HTML page that has been found. Table 0 is the one that I want. That shows me all of the different movies. I'll just select that one and hit Edit. In this query editor view, I can see all of the columns that were found from that web page. I'm actually only interested in these first two, the rank and title and the rating. So I'm going to choose to remove the other columns. And I want to split the rank and title up so that I've got separate columns for rank, title, and year. So I'm going to start by splitting that column. And I'm going to use the full stop to do this. And I'm just going to do it once at the leftmost delimiter. Now I've got my rank. And this shows title and year. So I need to split this one again. But this time, I'm going to split it on one of the left parentheses. That's title sorted out. And now, to just clean up this year column, I'm actually just going to replace that right parenthesis with nothing. That effectively just deletes it from this column. So now my year's sorted. The last thing I want to do is actually add a custom column that uh, shows me the decade that each movie was released. So I'll come to Add Column, choose Add Custom Column, column. and here I can type in a formula uh, that expresses pretty much anything that I want to transform this data. This is my formula. It just takes the first three digits of the year and appends 0s. I'm going to call this Decade. I'm done. The last thing I'll do is just name this query. This is our top 250 movies. So I'm finished with this data. I'm going to choose to close and load here. My data is loaded now, and I can see all of those columns over on the right-hand side. So let's take a look at some of these movies. Let's take a look at our title, the average rating, and maybe let's look at this as a bar chart. I probably want to sort this as well, so I'm going to come up and choose to sort it by rating. And I can see that the most popular movie on IMDb is The Godfather, followed by Shawshank Redemption. Let's take a look at some more, uh, some other charts. Well, let's insert a little pie chart, and let's take a look at the decades and the number of movies that were released in each decade. Well, I can see that the 2000s are the most uh, popular movie decade, followed by the 90s. What about those uh, average ratings by decade? Well, let's take a lo another look. Let's take a look at our decade. Uh, rating again. I want to actually see the average though this time. Let's look at this as a line chart. Well, I can see here that the best decade for movies was probably the 1990s, but the 70s were pretty close behind. So that was a really quick overview, just showing you how you can connect to data and transform it on the way into the Power BI desktop. Thanks very much.